Good evening Ibiza, it's that time of year again. It's BBC Radio 1, the busiest week of the year. Tonight you've got Calvin Harris at Ushuaia, BBC Radio 1 with just a massive lineup from Jamie Jones, MK, Becky Hill, Fisher, Eats Everything, here in Benamusa Park. Benamusa Park is what's known now as 528 and if you don't know where that is, it's pretty much the zoo project. So we're gonna go inside and uh, see what the vibe is. If I can catch any of the DJs, I will try and get them on camera. If not, it's gonna be a good day. So stay tuned and enjoy this one. As you see from the shots, it is now darkness. We've been in the green room, mixing with uh, all the artists so far today, having a good laugh with Eats Everything, Becky Hill's in there, um, Patrick Toppin, all the guys. Because it's the green room, I didn't want a video, so what I'm gonna do is go down and hopefully we can get backstage and get some better shots. It is super busy, um, but BBC Radio 1 have been looking after us really well. Haven't had to pay for any drinks. I am on drinking water. As many of you know, I'm on a health kick. Um, the after party tonight is at Pikes Hotel. We may go to that, probably won't film it, but we'll go down and you'll, you can get the vibe. You can hear Patrick Toppin in the background. The venue's open until 12 o'clock. As you see, it is a stunning place. I've been here before, I haven't done any videos, but we'll make our way down. Superb. Didn't really get to make the vlog I wanted to make. As you can see, the buses are here. It's like going back in time. I love this venue. It's probably one of the best venues, personally. Uh, it was formerly the Zoo Project and Benamusa Park, and now it's 528. Um, but yeah, everyone's here in the buses. Taxi queue looks busy. The after party is in Pikes Hotel. You need a band. Thankfully, we have a band. Um, so we're gonna pop up there. Whether or not I'll video it, I don't know. Oh shit. Um, I'm driving, so I'm gonna make my way back to the motor and uh, head home, get a freshen up, and go to Pikes. Thank you. What's happening now? I'm on my way to Pikes Hotel. Just had a bit of a freshen up. It's 2 a.m. Let's see how this one goes.
hi there that was bbc radio one and pikes that guy that you have just seen singing is roberto campoli and he's a good friend of mine he's my piano teacher as well but we haven't started doing the piano lessons don't think i'm going to be at his level anytime soon but we are going to get around to it um yeah pikes an intimate venue i love the place i don't want a video inside it you can't really anyway it's so dark if you've been to pikes you'll know what i mean and um, it was super busy it was a really one after party as i said um roberto is my jam i just wanted to see the live music I stayed with him he was playing all night i think i left around 3 a.m i drove home and i haven't slept um i did try to sleep i was super tired but i just was rolling around rolling around um as i said i haven't stopped the last couple of days and um, it's been good for the vlogs that vlog didn't go to plan i spent most of the time talking to the DJs and before we knew it we walked back out and the sun was down and the um, darkness was there. Everything I recorded in that vlog was recorded on my mobile phone so I was trying to get those shots so I hope, hope you appreciate the effort that went in to make that little bit of a vlog. Um, BBC Radio 1 was fantastic, thought it was going to be a bit of a disaster with the buses and the taxi situation, excuse me I'm slurring my words, um, but it wasn't, it ran really smoothly everyone was happy i didn't see any issues or any casualties or any trouble um but yeah all in all it was a good one and um, i want to thank everyone who has subscribed to the channel recently uh, i am going to continue doing the vlogs uh, i'm going to do one in san antonio today because i've been missing out and everyone is breaking my back to help them out and um, we got two major months left probably three months when you factor in the clubs won't close until the middle of october and then really what i do is my YouTube videos continue all through the winter. Not sure really what my plans is this winter. I am going to hang around, but I would like to get away for a month or two. Maybe go to South America if my health spares me and the money's okay. Um, all in all, I want to thank everyone for subscribing over the last couple of weeks. I think something like four or 500 people subscribed in the last two weeks. Mental. And yeah, the channel has now reached over 33 million people. So yeah, didn't ever think that was gonna happen. This is not an ad by Ibiza uh, UD, by the way. It's just so hot that I need to wear sports clothes in the daytime. And yeah, it is what? It's just about 10 in the morning. You'll probably watch this vlog in the next hour. Yeah, it's no, so it's 11 a.m. So by the time I upload this, it's probably gonna be about 12 a.m. I'm gonna stop talking, cause uh, I can go on a bit. Guys, if you need any help with booking tickets, do DM me. I know a lot of you have DM me on Instagram. Follow me on Instagram now, actually, if you can. DM me on Instagram, but be a bit specific, specific, and um, because a lot of people write a big paragraph and it's a lot of gibberish, and I can't really get through them all. I should be honest. Uh, and then, yeah, give me an insight as to what music you like. Just don't ask me what's good to go to, because you know, if you like trance, then you probably won't like the reggaeton nights, vice versa. I need a bit more in depth. I will be going back to doing vlogs around the island. So like the likes of Escana, got a hotel coming up in Santa Hilaria. I want to go back see Bart in the alpaca farm for sure. I miss him and the alpacas. I miss the alpacas more than I miss Bart. Um, and yeah, I want to do, yeah, I want to do more interviews. Danny from Clockwork unfortunately left the island. Um, I couldn't get a videographer to help me that one. I can do these videos for a certain period of time, but if it's a, a two hour video, it's very hard to um, actually put it together. But all in all, uh, I'm gonna continue, do the salmon video now, and I will see you tomorrow. Thank you, goodbye.